Typically games based on TV shows and movies tend to be bad, and that's due to them being nothing but quick cash grabs. The Lawnmower Man on the SNES isn't terrible, but it is terribly mediocre. The game is split into two parts, a 2D side-scrolling shooter and a 3D flying section, with you hopping between each one at different times. The side-scrolling sections are perfunctory. They work perfectly fine, but they're just not very interesting. You shoot some bad guys, fight a mini-boss occasionally, then just rinse and repeat. The 3D flying sections are visually impressive since the framework is consistently smooth, but again they're just not all that interesting to play. Nothing the Lawnmower Man offers is bad, there's just nothing that gives you that drive to keep playing. The only notable part of the game is the soundtrack. It's really good and makes use of the SNES's sound capabilities. It's so good that I got composer Alistair Brimble's permission to use some of the music in the title sequence for these reviews. The opening music is especially great, although it's never a good sign when the game peaks at the title screen. I honestly don't recommend playing the Lawnmower Man. It's a fairly bland affair that won't hold your attention for much time. You would honestly get more satisfaction finishing mowing a real lawn. Man, this is really satisfying.